After a four-day journey covering over 1,000 kilometers, four tank containers transporting 600 barrels of crude oil from Trukana County arrived at Kenya Petroleum Refineries Limited in Mombasa. This, the first of the 110 tank containers that will be used to ferry crude oil from the oil fields of Lokichar. It is our responsibility as KPC to ensure the product is received stored and ex later exported after reaching about 200,000 barrels, uh, which is uh, uh, ship cargo, which can be exported. We want to demonstrate today that the material that left Trokana has gotten a thousand kilometers away in the same volume and in the similar condition as when it was dispatched. This paving way for the next batch of four tank containers that will be leaving Lokicha on Friday. Government now saying it will take up to four months for them to be able to transport 2,000 barrels of crude oil a day. It's going to pick up within the next uh, uh, three, four months, up to December rather, to be close to about 100 trucks. We have spent another 200 million improving the facilities to receive early oil and we are spending another 1.8 billion improving other fast far other facilities here Talo however says that with the completion of an 865 kilometer pipeline between Lokichar and Lamu they will be transporting 80,000 barrels daily what we are hoping is in about 2021 2022 that volume will move many times over from 2,000 to not 20,000, not 40,000, but probably up to 80,000 barrels of oil a day. The construction of the pipeline is expected to begin next year at a cost of 110 billion shillings. The government expects to begin the export of crude oil in February next year. Mombiwarowe, Citizen Live at 9.